This video is sponsored by PageProof. Okay, this is exciting. Are you ready? You I'm feel ready. ready? I'm ready. All right. No, I think I'm ready. Yeah. <laughs> we'll find out. Hit it. Well, I uh, created this beautiful logo, a cheese logo, because I'm from the Netherlands, of course. Um, I named my company Dutch Delight. And you know the problem when you want to uh, scale your uh, text, you want to make it exactly the same height as your logo. But it's really tedious because you start scaling it moving it upwards again, so you know the feeling maybe. Well, there's a solution for that. Uh, if you go to the character panel, uh, you have this little hamburger menu up there, and you can add an extra field to the character panel. So when you uh, click show font height options, it will add a new field, and it will see, say, well, uh, I'm using the M box, so that's the bounding box to align objects. But if you change this to X height, it will calculate the X height of the text. Just, so the, just the text height. So if I just click on this uh, cheese logo and I uh, copy the height like this, Command C, and then select my text and then go inside my uh, text field and then double click and then paste it, then my text has exactly the same size as my cheese logo. So that's fun, isn't it? So, uh, and it also will appear in the uh, properties panel, so if you look in the properties panel, here's also the, the new uh, X height box, so you can use it there. Uh, but there's more fun, because uh, there's also text alignment. I created this nice Cheese Clarks logo, um, and um, it's the same logo actually, but, uh, <laughs> but yeah, you know, I, I, I used, uh, I used uh, another font. And, um, so it's different. Uh, yeah, so, so it's different, but you can see the bounding box here, so if you want to align uh, this text to this uh, logo, of course, you select it with shift click, but then the problem is that it aligns to the bounding box again and that the text isn't in the center of the cheese anymore. But there's a solution for that, of course. Uh, and you go, can go to the align panel or just to the, to the align panel in the properties panel, click the little hamburger icon, icon, and then say align to glyph bounds and then choose point text. So it will choose the point size of your text, click, and when you, when you select both the text and the logo, you can align the text like this, and now it aligns to the, uh, to the point height of the text, and that's very easy to use that, so uh, I'm finished, actually. Well. <laughs> so it's, uh, <laughs> thank you. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to our channel. And for thousands more how-to articles and tutorials, visit our website, creativepro.com, and become a member today. Thanks for learning with us.